Hi, Freaky Waves here. Today I'm gonna show you how to design a Womp Bass. Here's a little demo of what I will teach you to make today. So now we will start from scratch with a fresh new vital. First step, the oscillators. Enable the three oscillators and make them all sine waves. Click on the wave selector and select basic shapes. Then right click, copy, paste and paste. Next, the second oscillator is all sub, so set the transpose to minus 12. And the third one will be all super, so set the transpose to plus 12. Set the unison to three voices and one person detune on all of them. Second step, set up the filters. Make sure that all oscillators are rooted to the filter 1. Then set the filter mode to dirty 24 dB slope. Set it to high pass. Put the key track and drive on. And set the resonance to 0. Next, you want to route filter 1 into filter 2 by pressing this button. It will route the first filter output to the second one. Then set the filter 2 mode to 30, 24 dB. Leave it on low pass. Pull the drive and key track on. And set the resonance to 0. Third, the envelope. You want to set a very short attack of 0.07 seconds and pull the curve power a fair amount. The decay will be around 0.3 seconds. Sustain to 0.7 and set the release to around 0.4 seconds. Now we are going to set up the effects. Enable distortion and set the drive to around minus 7 dB. Next, enable the pre-filter, key track it using the note modulation, put it on bipolar mode, full range. Then tune the cutoff to about 70 semitones, resonance to 35% and set the blend to 2 to turn it into an high pass. Next, enable the filter, set the mode to dirty, 24 dB, turn the resonance down to 0. Finally, modulation. First, filter 1. Drag the envelope 1 to the cutoff and set the modulation to minus 12. Then filter 2, set the cutoff modulation to 36 and turn the cutoff down to minus 24. Now go back to the effects tab and set the drive modulation to 30. And finally, the filter. Set a cutoff modulation to plus 69 semitones to get a nice bass. So here is the result. If you have any question or if you want more, put some suggestion in the comments on what I should do next. I hope you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like and subscribe, enjoy life.